For the past few years, between 16 and 20 men and women have been identified as African billionaires. Venture Africa's latest list has more than doubled that number to 55. Ten African countries are represented, with Nigeria, South Africa and Egypt topping the list with 20, 9 and 8 billionaires respectively. The top three are all men. They are Nigeria's cement baron Aliko Dangote with 20.2 billion US dollars. South African investment guru Alan Gray with 8.5 billion dollars. And Nigerian business tycoon Mike Adenuga with 8 billion. While the increase of billionaires in Africa looks good on paper, several questions need to be asked in terms of equality. First off, only three women made the list. Nigerian oil tycoon and fashion designer Folorunsho Alakija is Africa's wealthiest woman. She has a net worth of $7.3 billion. Her fashion empire was built on humble beginnings and she eventually became an oil tycoon despite no experience in the industry. Second is Isabel dos Santos the daughter of Angolan President José Eduardo dos Santos. The investment magnet is worth $2.4 billion. Dos Santos made her fortune at a young age through lucrative state contracts. Her key assets include stakes in a mobile operator, a media conglomerate and Portuguese banks. And third is Mama Ngina Kenyatta, the widow of former Kenyan President Jomo Kenyatta. She's worth a billion dollars and is a key stakeholder in a number of Kenya's most successful companies. She earned her personal fortune in real estate through her late husband. Mama Angina supports philanthropic activities aimed at uplifting women and children. But as the number of extreme rich grow in Africa, the number of poor has been rising too. Africa may have 55 billionaires, but it also has around 414 million people who live on less than a dollar a day. Shanae Hale, Johannesburg. News that moves. ENCA.com.